Today, we are going to talk about rotoscoping, which is one of the most trending topics in After Effects. In this process, you can select any object within seconds. On the other hand, in Premiere Pro, we had to select objects manually, but not anymore. In Premiere Pro Beta, they introduced a new AI object masking tool that helps you remove any object's background or apply different effects with just a few clicks. Let's jump in and see how it works. For now, this feature is only available in the beta version of Premiere, so go ahead and download the beta version from Adobe Creative Cloud. This tool will be available in the official release soon, so don't worry. Once you launch the beta version, you will see the new object masking tool. Select it, then select your clip. If you hover over your footage, it should automatically highlight the object. This means if you have multiple objects in your clip, you can easily select them individually. Sometimes it may miss a part of your object. To fix this, simply draw a rectangle around it and you should see an outline appear. Now your object is selected. To track your selection across the entire entire clip, go to the Effect Controls panel and click the track icon. It will mask your entire clip, and once it's done, you'll see all the keyframes. Your object will stay highlighted throughout the whole video, which is a huge time saver since we've been manually masking in Premiere for years. And finally, Premiere is giving us this tool. As you can see, the mask shows up under the Unassigned Masks tab. If you want to remove the background, just drag the mask under the Opacity tab. Here you can also modify the selection if you want. With this new tool, you can do a lot of creative things like placing text behind an object, creating transitions. This is truly amazing, because now we don't need to open After Effects for rotoscoping. For example, you can easily put text behind any object. But before telling you how, make sure to subscribe and like this video. It will help me a lot to make more amazing videos for you. To put text behind an object, duplicate your clip and move the duplicate two tracks above, leaving one empty track in between. On the bottom clip, go to the effect controls and remove the selection. Then create any text you want and place Place it between the two layers. In this way, your text will appear perfectly behind the object in just seconds. No more manual masking. The same process can be used for many other effects. Overall, this feature is amazing. It's currently in beta, so the results may not be perfect yet. But once it's finalized in the official release, it will be more than good enough for professional use. So that's it for this video, and thank you so much for the love and support you showed on my last videos. It means a lot to me, and as always, I will see you in the next frame.